So this is, is an important aspect of your marketing. And anytime you send out an email to anyone, you can actually market to them within your signature. So let's go there first. I'm going to go to Yahoo first. Now, how this works is when you write a message in your Yahoo or your Gmail, this will automatically pop up for you so you don't have to type it out over and over again. Okay, so this is a signature file that I created just recently. And what I've done is, of course, I put my name in there, and then I put a little slogan in there as well. All this with zero out-of-pocket costs, and I have a link behind it. And if someone decided to open that link, and I'll show you what happens, I'm going to click on Open Link in New Tab, then the home page. You're always free. Well, I'm sorry, this page shows up. It's the Get Started page that shows up. Okay, and then, of course, my information is in here. Okay, so that's, you know, it's a way for someone to see what you're all about. Also, underneath I have Friend Me on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, read my blogs. And this is a great opportunity for you to share your Twitter and, and your other accounts. And so when someone clicks on it, and I'll just show you, I'm going to open it in another tab, it automatically goes to your Twitter, as you can see here. Okay? It automatically goes to your Facebook. as you can see here this is my Facebook and it will automatically go to where, whatever article writing platform you use or if you have a blog it'll go there as well okay if, depending on what link of course that you put it in and this is a great signature because they can find out all about you and just by reading whatever it is that you've sent them and they and if they want to know more about you they'll be able to in your signature okay now I've seen some people with signatures and they don't have this information so if you already know how to create your signature then just update it a bit with your important information okay so um, how do you do that well let me show you in this area where it has the tool here. Where am I? Okay. In this area. No, actually, this is different. I apologize. In the options area. And you see mail options right here. This is Yahoo. I got mixed up. I thought I was thinking I was in um, Gmail. But this is your mail options area. Let me move this back over. And you click on Mail Options. Okay. And over here, you should be able to see Signature. Okay. It's already clicked on Signature, but it might be on General. I'm going to say Okay. But it might be on General or something. But um, you want to make sure that you click on Signature. And then you'll have a box to where you can create your signature. Okay, and so I'm going to go ahead and do this over again for you. All right, I want to make sure I'm recording this. Okay, so I'm going to do this over. And one of the things that you want to do is I like to have um, a notepad okay my notepad up and usually if you have um, if you have Microsoft you can go to your start uh, at the bottom right of your screen and um, even in the search box you can click you can type in notepad and it will come up okay so if you don't know where it is alright so I like to bring up my notepad and I'll get that right now and put get put all the information that I need in it. For instance, I'm going to need my Wealth Creations Network link. And hopefully all of you know where that is. If not, let's go there right now. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and move this. 
All right, the Wealth Creations Network link is on your dashboard right in here. Okay? And just paste it in your notepad. You're going to need that. You're going to need your Twitter account link and your Facebook. If you have hub pages, you're going to need that. Okay, your YouTube, YouTube, you're going to need that. If you don't have YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter, you want to sign up for those. Okay, and just go to Twitter.com, go to hub, you know, YouTube. You can, those are easy to find, and start your your accounts there. And uh, we'll have training on how to to set up your profile and everything. But I think the signature file is probably going to be all we cover today. So I put all of the things in there, and I also kind of design how I want my signature on my notepad. Okay, and then I go back to this area. What I'm going to do is just delete this and show you how you do it. Okay, so I have my notepad. And I'm just going to copy and paste it the way I want it, right here. Okay. And then also put, pretend as though that this is actually my signature. But unfortunately, it, you know, you can't put your true signature in there, I guess. But anyway, I'm going to make this a little bit bigger. Make it a 14, bold it, and make it italics. Okay. So I just pretend that that's my handwriting there. All right, and then how do you put links behind here is probably what you're wondering. And so I'm going to show you. All this was zero out of pocket costs. All I do is I click on this globe and I insert my link. And remember, I put my link in here, so it's really handy. Starting at the HTTP colon all the way to the end, make sure there's no spaces behind it, and then just paste it in there, and then it becomes a link. It's as easy as that. Okay, and then now I want uh, folks to friend me on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube. So you have to go with each one of these. So Twitter, I have a Twitter account. My Twitter information is right here. Okay, so I'll just go to that globe with the link with the chain link there and click on OK and there's Twitter and you can you can test it as well just right click and I'm gonna uh, get out of here out of these things again okay I'm gonna show you how to, to, to test it as well and I'll do that all at one one time and I'll get rid of this too okay so friend me on Twitter, Facebook, oops, and you want to make sure that you just select, and now I'm going to link it, find your Facebook link, copy it, and when I copy, um, the fast way to copy is just press your control tab down, and then the letter C is in cat. Press it down, keep that control tab pressed down, and then uh, press down C, as in cat, and then lift up. You should have it copied. There's nothing that's going to tell you it's being copied, but that's how you copy it. Or, of course, you can right-click and copy as well. And then paste it. You can either right-click and paste, or control V as in Victor and paste. And there you have that. And then YouTube. I want to get my YouTube linked as well. Here's my YouTube. And as so I said, you can right click and copy it. And then right click and paste it. That's the easiest way, probably, for a lot of you. And then read my blogs. I'm going to right click. Well, before I right click, I need to get my hub page. Now, this could be your blog, this could be your hub page, this could be, you know, anything. Right click again, copy, then select, link, right click again, paste, OK. All right, so you've got all of these linked. Now, if you want to check it, 
then just right click on it and open in a, in a new link and check it's there you can close that one once again right click open link and there it is okay and so that's how you create a signature and this is in Yahoo alright so let's go ahead and go to Gmail